Hello folks, this is Jamil Swift for Gunstock Reviews. We're here at C2 Tactical in Scottsdale, Arizona, our favorite indoor facility, with some modifications that we did to the Springfield Armory Ronin operator in 9mm. Um, like I said before in our previous video, I really like the pistol the way it was, but the grips that come with it are the slimline wood grips. So it's two things that I like to change. Number one, wood, because they're too pretty. And here in Arizona, in our weather changes so much. In the summertime is hot and dry, then hot and humid, then that right now um, is wet and cold. So that wood tends to warp and do all sorts of goofy things. And they were thin. And I like the standard size grips. So we got Miltec grips and their magwell that is held together. The magwell is actually held together by the grips, okay? It's a really good Magwell design, and you can get it from Miltec. And Miltec, uh, we have these slants, it's not the diamonds. Miltec does OEM for Springfield Armory. The grips that come with the Springfield Armory uh, TRP are actually Miltec grips, okay? Uh, these are G10, these are gray and black. It's a color that goes well with this pistol. And I like the way this grips, and they have a, a cutout for ambi safeties, even though we don't need ambi safety. I don't like ambi safeties myself, but the magwell just went on real easy. Just put the magwell, put the grips on top of the magwell, and that's it. We were gonna replace the grip bushings, but we did not. We left the original grip, short grip bushings in it just in case anybody else wants to use the thinner grips before. We took out the Torx screws out. My point of view, and this is my opinion, okay, so don't yell at me for you know, saying this, I don't like torque screws because if they come loose on you, it's harder to put together if you don't happen to have the Torx bit or wrench with you. While if you have slotted screws like these from Wilson Combat, you can find a, a flathead screwdriver any place or you can use, I don't know, anything pretty much to use it. Um, even um, the mainspring in the back, the re uh, flathead sp flat spring that goes in the back of the pistol can be used as a screwdriver. So I've seen that done before. So we're gonna shoot it after replacing the grips, and I'll give you my opinion even though I already know because I've done this before, I like the way this fits. We're gonna be using Federal um, American Eagle 115 grain jacket hollow point, and we're not gonna shoot that much because of course ammo nowadays is more expensive than guns. Let's go shoot it. <laughs> Now, that's nice, okay? That is really nice. I really like the way it feels. It, it felt great before, but now with the bigger grips, it just gives me a better grip on it. I mean, it just fits my hand perfectly well. Uh, what can I say, Evan? It's your choice what grips you're gonna put in it. it. Whatever fits more comfortable in your hands is what you should put on. If you like wood, Look, have at it, the grips that come with it are beautiful, just not for me, okay? So again, folks, I'm gonna keep shooting it, but again, stay healthy, stay safe, and have fun at the range. Thank you for watching Gunstock Reviews. Please visit our website at www.gunstockreviews.com for more exclusive content. Please visit our patron page at www.patron.com slash gunstockreviews. Your contributions would be greatly appreciated and help us grow our selections and frequency of videos.